guys, it's Lee, and I am back today with another Dollar Tree haul for you. And I'm back with this really awesome voice. I don't know what happened. I woke up sounding like this. I don't really feel sick. Um, but this does happen to me like once a year or every couple of years. So who knows? Probably because we had cold weather, then really warm weather, then cold weather, then really warm weather. So I'm guessing that's what it is. And I'm hoping. It just stays at this and I don't actually get sick. So cross your fingers for me. Sorry if you can hear my washing machine spinning upstairs. Um, this haul is stuff that I bought a couple of days ago. Everything is off a bit. The haul that I put up on Tuesday was meant to go up last Friday, but on Friday, instead of you know recording and editing a video, a deer jumped and hit my car. I was gonna say I hit a deer, but really it hit me. I'll put some pictures of my car up right now so you can see the damage. Luckily, the damage isn't too bad. It's just that it's gonna take forever to fix because of supply chain issues and so many people hitting deer right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you this stuff, um, which was meant to go up earlier this week. So I apologize for that. But then after I show you these items, I will have pictures of items I saw but didn't need, um, but I thought you might like to see them, so make sure you hang around for those. I picked up more of these home essentials, yeah, home essentials bowls that are made in Portugal, and I don't know if you guys noticed in the last haul, because I certainly didn't notice until I was putting away everything I had hauled, that these like teal colored ones um, I only picked up three of those. The fourth one was the blue one. So I went ahead and found, or got three of the blue ones to match and one more of this teal green color, just so we have four of each. They're super pretty and I will use these for all sorts of things. Well, the kids might take them. If the kids don't take them, when they move out, everybody keeps think I'm, thinking I'm trying to kick my kids out. I'm not, they can stay as long as I want. I like them here. Um, all right, so I also found them in black, which is what I'm gonna get next. This is what the black ones look like. And I did pick up four of these as well. I really like the design on them. And these are for me. I'm gonna keep these for myself. I just think they'd be really pretty as serving bowls. My husband sometimes has friends over for football games, and I think that you know you could put dips and nuts and all kinds of stuff in those bowls, and they're really pretty. And I found these shower headbands by Spa April Bath and Shower. So I got this cheetah print one for my daughter, and the pink polka dotted one for me because I like pink and she doesn't. <laughs> this is what they look like. They have a bow on them. I think it's so cute for, you know, washing your face. I, I just think it's so cute. So I got those for us. Next, I grabbed some of these jumbo plastic clothespins. I got two packs of them. You get six in a pack and I almost picked some up at Target the other day, but I remember Dollar Tree had them. And now for the life of me, I can't remember what the price was in Target but they are cheaper at Dollar Tree. And I don't know if the quality is, what the quality is like, but for what I need them for, it's not gonna be that big of a deal. So I don't need them to hold up anything super heavy. So I just picked up two packs of those. One of the Dollar Tree stores I went to had so many blind bags, like so many. I took pictures of them, so you'll get to see them in the picture section but I did pick up these uh, these are Disney Dorables 62 to collect and did this one have different numbers on the back no all the numbers on the back are the same but I love some Dis well I love Marie and Tinkerbell and I don't even know let me open one let's see what's in this one I can open this one Oh, yeah, it's Nemo. I had to check the fins. Look how cute. Kind of wish I'd picked up a few more of these now. 
By the time I go back, they'll probably be gone. So cute. Let's see. So here's the list of what they have. They have Cinderella, Finding Nemo, Aladdin, Toy Story, Lilo and Stitch, Beauty and the... Did I show you Lilo and Stitch? Beauty and the Beast, Mickey and Friends, The Little Mermaid, Tangled, The Lion King, and Frozen. So they don't have Marie or Tinkerbell, so I won't be going back to get more. But these are super adorable. Look how cute. I guess that's why they're called Dorables. But this is what the package looks like. And then I found these SpongeBob SquarePants Build It's. So this is Build It Patrick. It says collect them all. They're not blind bags. So as far as I can tell, there are only three of them. So I got Build It Patrick, Build It SpongeBob, and it says that there are 25 plus bricks in each one, and Build It Squidward. I am planning on hanging on to these and then putting them in the Toys for Tots. Hopefully they'll leave them together so one kid gets all three of them. I just think they're really cute and my kids loved Spongebob, but I don't think they want Spongebob um, Lego sets or off-brand Lego sets. Next I picked up two of these dish drying mats. I love the print on them, the holly leaves and I don't know what those berries are. Anyway, and then there are, um, there's pine on it as well. I think it's really pretty. And I'm going to use these to put under the pet's dishes, the cat and the chihuahuas. The greyhound has a raised um, food and water bowl, so he doesn't need this. But I'm putting it under their dishes so that it, you know, they don't know it's Christmas, but I do. Or will be Christmas, but I do. <laughs> I got another little tree skirt. I have a little tree for the advent calendar thing I'm going to be doing and then another little tree. Anyway, I can't decide which ones I want to use where. So I went ahead and picked this one up. So I think I have one of all three now that the Dollar Tree has out this year. So then I found these Christmas boxes and this one has a dachshund on this side. I love these boxes. It has a, I don't know what dog that is on that side has like a little Pomeranian and a Beagle, and I'm guessing a Husky. What is that? Some kind of Bulldog? I have no idea. Anyway, it's super cute, and I love these boxes for decorations. I'm gonna use them for decorations, but they do make really nice uh, gift boxes as well, so I got the big one and the small one. They are exactly <laughs> the same. picked up some curling ribbon in red, shiny red. It's by Voila and it is 3 sixteenths of an inch wide and 780 inches. Words are hard. I just wanted one of those. And then I also picked up one of these because it's so pretty. Um, also this one is by Christmas House and it is just over half an inch wide and it's 108 inches but I love the red background with the gold snowflakes. So I got one of those. Then for my tree, which I think I've decided to go ahead and put up a tree. I'd said in a previous haul that I kind of didn't feel like it, but I might. I'm leaning more towards putting it up. Anyway, I got these decorative bells in gold. You get nine of them. And then I also got them in red. I don't need more ornaments for the tree, but sometimes, you know, something a little different. So I picked these up. And then lastly, this is a small one today. I got these little, well, they're calling them ornaments. They're gift boxes. I'm going to be using them under one of my little trees so that there are presents under the tree because I think that's really cute. So I got the black and white buffalo plaid and it has twine around it and the little holly berries and pine cones and then this red and um, black buffalo check with the same thing on the top. Anyway, that's, that's everything I picked up this time around at 
like three or four different stores. It's all I found that I really wanted. Um, but I did find some other cool stuff and I will show you those pictures right now. So make sure after you watch those pictures, you meet me right back here. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed those pictures and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye.